What's up everyone? Welcome to the 2010 PowerManiac.com Fantasy Outlook video for Anthony Gonzalez. Um, Anthony Gonzalez was a very trendy pick last year. Um, I was a victim of the injury. Got him in 5th round, 12 team drafts, expecting big things. And uh, yeah, he goes down week 1. And then we have the hodgepodge fill-in from Austin Colley and Pierre Garçon. Um, there's been rumors that um, Gonzalez is going to get a chance to compete on the outside for Garcon, with Garcon, and I don't see him having any chance to win that job. Uh, Garcon's taller, a little bit longer, built a really good rapport with Peyton Manning down the stretch last year, and I look for that momentum to continue. Gonzalez has said that he's anti-slot, but um, I think he needs to wise up because he'd be a good fit in there. He's better than Austin Colley. Um, and the thing about Anthony Gonzalez, I'm not, I'm not a big uh, Austin Colley guy this year, but um, Gonzalez hasn't beat out Colley yet. But if I had to guess, you've had Wayne and Garcon on the outside and Gonzalez on the inside. If you're drafting now or sometime before the starting job gets sorted out, you get a steal. I've got, in 12 team leagues, I've been getting you know, Anthony Gonzalez on the 12th round, after the 12th round at the earliest. You know, some leagues have got him in the 14th, 15th, 16th round, depending on how deep your draft goes. So he's a really good value there. Um, I'm not generally um, a guy that likes to uh, take third wide receivers. I'd rather, ha you know, focus my wide receiver attention on first wide receivers or second wide receivers. But to get a guy that is a third wide receiver in a great offense that late and will probably have some, some big games, maybe get him as a bye week uh, you know, fill-in, or maybe Garcon gets hurt and he takes over the starting role on the outside, or, you know, God forbid, Reggie Wayne, you know, a guy could end up having a lot more value. Um, so, Anthony Gonzalez, great value. Um, the knee, you know, we'll have to see if his knee's completely healthy, but I haven't heard anything about it being, you know, any kind of setbacks. So, we'll have to wait and see. But, uh, yeah, he's definitely a guy that I would target late. Um, Dynasty League's really sneaky play. If you're in a brand new Dynasty League or a free agent Dynasty League draft, um, you can get this guy really late. This is only going to be his third year. So he could end up being, you know, a staple in that Colts offense for years to come. So sneaky play there if that's the route that you want to go. So that's all you need to know about Anthony Gonzalez. If you guys are on Twitter, give us a call, give us a holler at Pyromaniac with a one instead of an I. You can follow me at Pyro Lion, Pyro underscore Lion. If you like this shirt, get it at our web store. You can also pick up our 2010 draft kit at the web store. It's only $7.50. We've got, you know, over 200 player profiles, including art, offensive line previews, pros and cons, and on and on and on. Really good value, a lot of bang for your buck. Also make sure to bookmark the fantasyfootballpharmacy.com. We're in our final stages of development as this video is being filmed. So hopefully by the time you watch this, it'll be up. So bookmark it at fantasyfootballpharmacy.com or fffharmacy.com. Yeah, go Phillies.